As someone who completely understands this is 72-year-old Liz Hodgkinson and she joins us now. Good morning to you, Liz. You totally understand where Diane is coming from. You say <laughs> you've, you've given up on this. I've completely given up, yes, but I do understand uh, where Diane's coming from, um, particularly as, uh, yes, she's had a lot of famous uh, lovers in her time, so she admitted on the programme, um, but now she finds herself alone, and I think a lot of uh, women of, uh, in our age group are uh, finding ourselves in the same position, you know, they're, they're, they're just isn't anybody all the old screen gods are no longer screen gods and all the wonderful young men of our youth are now old and decrepit or if they're still here and uh, yes it's a it's a complete desert i think as far as we're concerned well that's what i was going to ask you uh liz how's your sex life <laughs> well non-existent yeah. oh, <laughs> but liz you are you are gorgeous and you say that's part of the problem really like oh, the I, sort of I, no, 70 year old I think what happens yeah i mean I think what happens now is that we're the first generation, we're, you know, we're the baby boomers, we've had everything our own way, and um, uh, we're the first generation of women in our age group who don't look old and who aren't old. I mean, my grandmother at my age looked incredibly elderly, and... Um, so did most people's grannies. But now, you know, uh, we're in a different era and I think the men haven't caught up. You know, they haven't... We've, we've worked really, really hard to keep ourselves looking young and we go to the gym and we go and um, have our hair well, done. Why don't you go for a younger man then? Uh, well, there's <laughs> yeah, there's problems with the younger men. I can't... I, I, you know, I haven't been able to find one of those either. Depends what you call younger, I suppose. I mean, for me, a 50-year-old would be younger. But wow. they're, they're already quite old, you know, um, uh, or elderly. How, how do, <laughs> so how do you satisfy your... <laughs> they're elderly in their, in their habits and their... You know, even the 50-year-olds, they've, they've kind of got old somehow. I think men age much quicker than women do, and that's the complete opposite to what we've always been told. Isn't that amazing. So, so you satisfy your sexual desires and urges by going to the gym? Well, I don't know whether it satisfies it exactly, but it displaces <laughs> it for a bit. You know. It gives me something else to think about. Okay. Well, uh, Liz, thank you very much indeed for talking to us <laughs> okay. uh, today. Thank uh, you. This is